The United Labour Congress of Nigeria has threatened to go on strike by 12 midnight on Friday. Correspondent Sharon Ijasson was at a conference organized by the union to remind the government of the impending strike. There are indications that industrial unrest in the country may worsen from Friday 15th of September 2017 if the government does not meet the demand of the United Labour Congress. Some of the labor unions affiliated to it are the Nigerian Union of Petroleum and Natural Gas Workers Union Nupeng, National Union of Electricity Employees Nui, National Association of Aviation Professionals, amongst others. Some of their demands are the immediate inauguration of the National Minimum Wage Negotiation Committee, the release of registration certificate of the United Labour Congress, that the federal government should stop the stationing of soldiers and policemen in workplaces and factory premises, that the Federal Ministry of Labor set up a tax force immediately to carry out factory inspections, immediate review of the privatization of the power holding company of Nigeria, immediate payment of all the arrears of salaries owed Nigerian workers at all levels of government, that the roads leading to all the petroleum refineries and depot nationwide be repaired, amongst others. USC urges all Nigerians to therefore take precaution and stop basic needs as the strike will be very effective as we hope to touch the critical sectors where we <laughs> operate in, including power, electricity supply, banking, and others and the aviation. The General Secretary of the Union, Didi Adodo, said the 14 days ultimatum issued to the federal government expired Friday, September 8, 2017, noting that the government's response did not address issues raised. A letter that didn't say anything. They just wrote us that uh, your demands we have already met and whether they have not met anyone. For instance, Delta Steel workers, they should change them. The Nupeng president, who is also the deputy president of United Labour Congress, also spoke on the development. Most critically, you will also agree in our demands, we talk about uh, the, the recognitions of ULC, the issuance of a certificate, which is very critical. It is a fundamental right. Nobody can take that away from us. The decision to commence an industrial action was reached after an emergency national administrative committee meeting held with the National Strike Committee of the United Labour Congress. Sharon Ijasson, TVC News, Lagos.